Hello and welcome back to uh, Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. Last time we went through the Deepwood Shrine, defeated the giant green choo choo, and got the Earth Element. Now we're going our way back to see the Minish Elder and see what he has to say next. So, you have found the Earth Element. You are blessed with much courage and strength for one so young. If your conviction holds strong, head to the blah blah, blah what you will call it. There you will find a man named Malari. Among the Mish, there is no one more able to repair your sword. If you ask him, he will surely reforge a broken Pecori blade. I shall send word to him in advance. Travel safely, and you are you are brave, but there are many evils now in the world. Yep. Now if you see up there, those four symbols, those are the elements. The elemental blah blah blahs. Mount Crenel. And see, this is what I'm talking about where you'll, you'll likely forget because you wind up leaving out this way instead of the other way down there to go back. Anyway, head in here and talk to this guy. Green clothes, a mystical hat. Sir, would you be. By, would you by chance be Link, the one who found the Earth Element? Why, yes, I am. Really? I thought it was one thing, and now I'm famous already. Woohoo! I am Bellari, researcher of antiquities. I am also, well, a bit of an inventor. You know you won't be able to get back to town to root all the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. You got a bomb bag. Bomb bada bomb bada bomb. <laughs> There's ten bombs. You blow lots of stuff up. Hooray! We're now a terrorist. You can blow things up. Anyway. Now I'll get back to normal size, and it's time to kick ass. Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of war. What the hell? It just exploded. Hmm. Whoa, it blew up. Hey kid, look at where that stone used to be. There's some strange symbol on the ground. Yes, of course. Why? That must be, well, I haven't the this, to be honest. Hmm. That shall be explained later. And it's quite helpful indeed. No, confuser. Mm, nothing of interest yet. And now do you set? Nope, not change bomb. No, I missed that. In, uh, at least Phantom Hourglass being able to slice the bombs and make them instantaneously explode. Makes the game a lot faster. Oh god, no, I'm dead. Speaking of Phantom Hourglass, it'd be nice to have to do an LP of that. But I would not be able to do it. I mean, I could probably get a DS emulator run decently. But the touch screen, I can't use that with a mouse. I've tried. It doesn't work right for me. Is there any point doing this? Ooh, let's slide out. Look at this kingstone piece. Have you ever seen one like this? What? You want know, well, I'll tell you what. Why don't you come back and see what you get? Yep, now nah, well, we're getting into the meat of that. The meat of the 100%ing this game. Once you get back to town, anyway. It's a wall to blow up. Go in and. Ooh, just. More mysterious shields. Oh god, it's a pea hat. Eh, might as well blow those up just for the sake of convenience for now. More mysterious shells. Oh yeah, I might as well show them. If you don't kill them like that, they are a stack of giant things and yeah. Slightly annoying, but can give you more money if you want. Spoils. Anyway, finally made it back to Castletown. Or Hyrule Town, as it's actually called. Come on, come all. See how many kinstone pieces you can collect. You never know if using kinstones will do, but it's sure to be good. Come on up and get your free kinstone bag for holding your kinstone pieces today. Don't miss out on this incredible once-in-a-lifetime opportunity! 
It's just you're here for your free tea bag, aren't you? That's right. Maybe you didn't hear me, but they're free for all kids right now. An old, a creepy man giving out a bunch of bags to kids. That 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 doesn't seem right. Oh anyway, yes, this. When you see people with that symbol, you press the L button to fuse kinstones. Yes, I understand. So, you see, these, all of these trigger small events throughout the uh, world. And the fact that you have, the thing is, they aren't that common of an item to get from cutting grass, shrubs, plants, and creatures. And the three child small children decide to continue following. Yes. Anyway. They're... I wonder. Can I learn anything new yet? Simply, if I switch my alarm, if you train with me, I guarantee you will. Yes, I'd like to train here. We shall start with the most basic of all takes. You have a spin attack. First, press and hold your sword button. Second, build up enough power. Third, release your destructive might. That's all, young swordsman. Do you understand? Yes. Haha, very good. You're a quick student. But one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body and disarm the swift blade switcheroo technique of training. Switch. Ah, roo. Phew, now you must try it for yourself. Press and hold your sword button. Build up enough power, then release your destructive knife. Woo! Yes, fine work here. Quick study. Now I give you this tiger scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can review it with this scroll. If you view it any time at the quest desk. You learn to spin attack. First sword to make the eight is the only thing you can learn. Yeah, eight. Oh, um, I just cracked the bomb in his house. Kitty! Anyways, I might guess for now I might as well show around Castle Town. We got food bar in place thing here. Get your items item shop over here. How much is this large ball? Oh. Eight rupees for a wall. Eh, not enough yet. Uh, that'll come in handy for a side quest. More houses for Sort of side quest. This is nice. Uh, yes, this is mini game hut. Uh, this you gotta clear up for another shop person. Shop another shop person will be here at some point. And then here when you with Kinstone, and then you got you got your bakery here, which is meh. Can't remember at this point. Here you've got the hotel, which I can I'm gonna go and... Nope. Okay. Rage. You've got the hotel, you got the mayor's house, you've got the school up there, north to uh, the castle, the library up here, post office here, and unfortunately you can't go down yet. Dog's in the way because he wants to be noticed. Anyway. Oh, so you're able to learn something. It's still dangerous, but maybe you can handle it. Let's see how you do. Show off to Okay, I killed you. Yep. There are monsters up there. Make sure you're careful. Yep. Trilby Highlands. Mm, can't go down that way. No. You die. We've got to go this way. Uh, is there anything? Nope. Nothing important yet. Oh, Krenal's base. 
bum bada bum bada bum bada bum No, oh, that's one. Well, I see money up here. I'll go and take that. Free money! Money, 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 money. Free money. Oh, wait. You need shield for this. Pound. Stupid new. Okay, you got me. I'll make it up to you by selling something good to you. For mine. There's a handy tool. You want to climb it? Ah, rage. I do have to go. Man. Sack of crap. That's all fine and dandy, I guess. Nope. Oh god. Almost blew myself up. And he got a bottle for 20 rupees. And uh, so a bottle. And this will come in handy later. Too sweet to push this block by yourself. Hint, by yourself. Anyway, get water in your bottle. And head over to Mount Crow. And... Okay, yeah, it works. And you make plants grow. Hey, I'm pretty sure these are tech tights, if I'm correct. Oh god, giant boulder. Yep, dangerous, no climb. Can't even climb. No, you die. I see a, I see a bomb. Bomb spot. Hey, free money and free fairies. And it's not worth, it really isn't worth putting a, um, carrying a bottle in here because you're gonna need to use your uh, bottle for other things and chances are you're probably not gonna die by the time you get there and you're probably not gonna be dead but before you get there so oh man but, yeah stupid nope you're dead <laughs> Another yeah, it's a bomb of rock. Let's go and then shrink down. That's gotta hurt. I'm landing on I'm landing on rocks. This is perfectly normal stoking and there's another portal time mission. What you gotta do is set your bottle once again. Go all the way up here and get piping hot, piping hot milk tree and mineral water. Or spring, whatever. Same thing. Now you're gonna wanna get out and go to the left. Or grow again, go back to normal size. <coughs> and then go back down over here. Because this mountain is color coordinated. And another. Another one. Rage. I'll kill you if you see if you drop bomb. I don't need life, I need bombs. Rage. Bombs? No! No bomb. Money. I need bombs! Rage face. Eh, whatever. Continuing on, I suppose. Oh. What do you have to sell? Eh, not right now. Rage. I'm really going to spend money on these bombs. Of course. Well, there goes half my money. Just under half my money. 
rage. We go across the pitfall. And then up the ladder. Or stairs, actually. And these guys, you got in order to kill them, you guys either attack them from behind or suck their iron masks on. Nope, get, get back here. There is no escape. Rage. Nothing. Oh well. Continuing on. Ow, oh, you bastard. Let's go down. I'm gonna slice you in the back and kill you. Hmm. Yep. I can fly. I can fly. Whee! Nope. Nope. Gotta go up high actually. Gotta go up to that one. Nope. You died. No, it was up here. Was there another one? Yep. Oh yeah, and listen. You hear that? Different noise than that? That means it's a, it's a wall that you can blow up. Here is items. <coughs> Piece of hearts, three or four. Nope, that's four or four. Nice. And kinstone piece. Which yeah, you can get those from I don't know, fifty rupees. You can get kinstone pieces from enemies, chests some certain chests and grass shrubs and all that other stuff. That's why they're not very common, actually. Now that we're large, we can cover those things easily. Now to the other way. Alright. Shrink down. And now to get that... Now we gotta bring the seat all the way back down. Now we gotta put it in that hole over there. While falling to our death and getting crushed by it. <laughs> Anyways. Nope. Jump up and then back down that way. And then swap out to the bottle. Well, don't do what I did. Make sure you're facing the plant when you drop it. <sighs> uh, yeah, you know what? I'll check that out now. Like I said, I want to get 100%. I want to try my best to get as close to 100% as I can. Small dungeon is small. Just make sure you don't die. Do oop, spikes. Don't touch spikes and pin stone piece. Almost about I think about halfway up Mount Crannel now. Oh crap. So what lies up this stock? Find out next time on Minish Cap. <laughs>